Hey guys, it's Tom Cousins here. Today we are in Seaside Heights, New Jersey, a casino pier for the Ace Event Seaside Hangover. This is an event where you come down and you pay $25 to get an unlimited wristband. And of course, Casino Pier does let you film as long as you check in at guest relations. But really excited to get on those rides. You might be wondering why I'm down here, not over there. We got here kind of late because I got home from Hershey last night at like 2.30 in the morning. So I needed some sleep. I had to get that video edited for you guys. But you're down here at the carousel now because we are getting a free ride on the new carousel. Ken is with us and Ken is actually right in front of his horse right there. His name Ken. So we're going to be getting a free ride on this awesome carousel down here in Seaside Heights. This was restored. It's a very historic ride. Um, so I'm very grateful that we're going to get to hop on and check it out. We just did the carousel of Seaside Heights. This is a very historic carousel. You could see all of the history as we went around the carousel. So much really cool stuff. And Ken, you even have your very own horse. Yeah, I didn't ride it because my horse does not go up and down. I wanted one that goes up and down. Ken's horse is like the base model. He's not yeah, the, the so premium I, model. I wanted the one that I can. <laughs> but uh, it's beautiful at this age in Carousel. Absolutely. It's a really nice spot, too. It's not really right next to Casino Pier, so just for perspective. Skyride ends kind of over there. That's where this is. All the way over there, you can see the Sky Coaster, Hydras, and everything. So it's not really too far of a walk, maybe five minutes at a leisurely pace. But definitely come check this out, even if you don't ride it, just to see the history of it, the organ going. It's it's a really nice setup. And once we go inside the park, because we're going to get food right now, you'll notice that it's pretty empty here. That's because this time of year is what the locals of Jersey call local summer, where none of the tourists come here from New York or anything like that and it tends to be very not crowded around here, which is great for us locals because this is the time we wanna to go to the parks and to the piers and boardwalks, beaches, all that, because there's not that many people here. It's all local New Jerseyans, and honestly, definitely the best time to go. If you can come here for Seaside Hangover or Screams, because it is usually pretty early in the season, I'd highly recommend it. We are here at Maruka's having some pizza. Ken insisted that we come here. Look at the size of this pie. It's the extra large pie. It's all right, we have ventured our way into Casino Pier finally, and I think our first ride is going to be Pirates of Hideaway. We're not going to go on anything too crazy yet to let our food digest. Then we'll be getting on the rotor, which is new for this year, which I'm really excited for because I haven't been on a proper rotor before, so that's going to be a new experience for me. It's actually right there. So excited to ride that ride. We're also going to ride Skyscraper right there. Of course, Pirates Highway, which we're going to now. Probably Zola Loca, Hydra, Centrifuge. So many great rides to this little park. that lovely creation right there, Ken. Uh. <laughs> it's something. Uh, now it is time for Zola Loco, the 360 car, of course, because that is the best way to ride this. And we have the 360 camera for it. So this should be a pretty interesting visual. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Just did Center Vuge, and I believe the song was Animals by Nickelback, and it was actually pretty good for the ride. Uh, of course, shout out to the DJ, Adam. He always does a great job with the song choice and the lighting. You actually control it manually. You pick the lights and everything, because I believe last year I was here, I got to DJ it, which was really cool. So always got to give a ride to Center Vuge. Just keep in mind, you do not 
um, you will not be able to ride if you're a single rider. You have to have two people or more. So just keep that in mind. But now it is time for Hydras. both ways. Just rode Hydras three times. Of course, got it on video with this, which is actually the first time I filmed on this with an Insta360. So cool to get a little bit of a different type of content here, but it's great as always. Great airtime. And unlike a lot of the other Gerslauers, this one is still really, really smooth. Now I think our stomachs are finally ready for zero gravity. So that rotor was absolutely insane. I have never felt that strong of force on a ride. I mean, just mind blowing how intense that was. Now I'm gonna go on Skyscraper because the other two are, uh, let's just say too scared to go on. So I'm going solo. We got this nice one. Don't go upside down yet. Right. Very soon we're gonna be upside down and facing the Atlantic Ocean. Right about now. Oh, yeah. This ride is very aggressive. Skyscraper definitely still holds up as one of my all-time favorite flat rides, especially with that view of the ocean. And recently I got to ride the larger version of this being Adirondack Outlaw at Six Flags Great Escape. And I don't know if I like that one better or this one better because it's a completely different type of flip and force because this one is the smaller model compared to Adirondack Outlaw, but just an absolutely awesome ride. And for those of you that visit Casino Pier often, you'll notice that the Fun Factory is missing. That's because they're building a brand new one for 2025 it's gonna be a permanent installation not the uh, traveling version so it's gonna be great to see when that comes in next year oh. <laughs> We just did short shot, but I didn't ask you guys what you thought of the rotor. How was it? Uh, the rotor brought back a lot of memories of going on rotors past. And this one is just fantastic. I mean, it's fast and you are stuck to that wall. Big time. It's it's insane. The rotor, it, it just starts instantly. You're stuck to that wall. And I think the cycle may be a little too long. Just it's, a little. It's like, yeah. you're, it's like you're in a washing machine, the dry, the dry cycle of the washing machine. It's it's intense. Absolutely. And we did short shot. Short shot, as usual, as I'm sure you guys agree, was great. We were able to get a really good vantage point going all the way down the boardwalk along the beach. There's a lot of people here, lots of locals, I'm sure. Uh, I'm not sure how many more rides we're going to do. I mean, we pretty much rode everything we want to ride. Like I said, Seaside Hangover and just this time of year in general is a great time to come down here. Very low crowds, very kind of nice, lax atmosphere without all the tourists and everyone. Just a really nice time to come here and I highly recommend the Ace event, it's a great deal. But we are gonna be going to Great Adventure later and that video is probably already out, so that is gonna be the first time we go to Fright Fest this year. It's the Fright Fest preview weekend, so not full Fright Fest, but 
glad we were able to come here. We're not leaving quite yet, but I love Casino Pier. One of my favorite boardwalk parks. Hydras is great. So many excellent rides here at the pier. Got ourselves Coors, which is the best ice cream you can get on the boardwalk, but that is going to do it for our time here in Seaside. It was a quick visit, but we got to go on quite a few rides, get some good footage for you guys, and just have a great time, Dad. How was Seaside? Uh, it's always great coming down here. It was really great getting on that new rotor ride, Zero Gravity. Absolutely. Ken? Well, I really had a hangover today from Hershey, so... <laughs> the Hershey hangover. Uh, I'm about done. <laughs> yeah, I feel that. We are going to be going, at least not Ken, but we are going to be going to Great Adventure, so we'll see how that goes. But that video is already out. If you guys enjoyed this one, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye, guys.